Hi, I'm Rodney Gaylord, owner of Easy Tro. We're here at Bunch Marine in Harriman, Tennessee. We've got a new product called the Easy Tro Utility Tray. This is a tray that uh, fits in different kind of compartments. We're going to go around today in the showroom and see what compartments this fits in. Okay, we're over here at a Triton 21 HP. Uh, I've already did the measurements. Uh, we should be cutting for the bilge area uh, 10 and 7 8. We're going to go over here and cut one and kind of show you how it fits. And we got some other boats that we're going to show you uh, what needs to be cut on those. So here we go. Okay, we're over here getting ready to cut on the utility tray to, sh to put it in the boat. And uh, I've did a couple of measurements. Uh, we want to be at 10 and 7 8 to fit the, uh, the boat. And what I've did is, I know you probably can't see it, but I've took and measured in about an inch on this side and did a mark and an inch and did a mark. And then I just put a straight edge on it and marked my line for cutting. Uh, I'm gonna cut this much off of, of this side and then I'll come over to 10 and 7 eighths and did a mark and a, another mark down here. And I've also turned it with my straight edge and did another mark for a cut edge. So uh, I'm going to cut this out and we're going to uh, cut real quick here. Shouldn't take just a second. We'll start with this side over here first. And I'm just holding it down. It's uh, plenty of room. So we've got plenty of room to go a cutting. We're going to trim it out. Okay, we're going to start cutting now and uh, trim it out. It's real simple to cut, easy to cut, and you can take a, a regular knife and you can actually just kind of trim your little burr off, scraping it sideways on the knife, gives you a little bit of better edge, and you could uh, just trim off the little, the little chip on it on both sides, just like that right there, do the other side. go. Now that's ready to be put in the boat. We'll put us some uh, Velcro in a couple of spots so it won't slide around in your boat. Uh, simple to do. Cut the fit. Now you, we can also cut it for other parts of the boats, uh, a different where the latch is. We can actually cut out a spot for it or cut it down short. Uh, let's go look at it and see how it fits in the boat. Okay, we're here at the boat. We're going to try to see what we did here. See how it looks. Just drops right in. Now we can see that it uh, looks like great, great area. You can put your, your uh, whatever you would want to put in there, some accessory stuff. Door still shuts great. Opens, closes easy. Now we do have the Velcro with it, so if you want to put some Velcro strips on it, you can. So it won't uh, move and then you just snap it out with the Velcro. Uh, we're going to go around and look at some other boats and see what we got on them of installing one. Uh, we've got, uh, we've done, looked at the uh, different Tritons. We've got a Triton uh, Pro Series over here, the 18-foot Pro. On it, you will have to trim off a little bit more. I think it was uh, uh, 10 and 10 and a quarter or 10 and a half. I'll have to re-measure it, but just make sure you measure before you cut. But you did have to cut off on each side of it. Uh, the uh, Triton 19-foot uh, XS, uh, it, it was the same tray as this one, uh, so it's the same cut as the 10 and uh, 7 eighths, so it fit right in the back of it, so uh, let's go around and search some other boats. Okay, we're here at a low uh, Stinger 120, uh, 175, uh, it'll fit in this compartment up here at the front, uh, 
uh, just easily you drop it in. You can see easily it'll fit here. Uh, now what we'll do, of course, is the same thing. You'll cut off a, a, a section about like this, and I would actually probably flip it around once it's cut, make it fit that way so the, you can see it be a lot better on the name and everything. But uh, it'll fit in, the, in this compartment, and we're gonna go hunt another boat. Okay, we're here at the Ranger with a Ranger a Z520C. Uh, we're gonna look at the different compartments. Uh, we looked at the, the uh, storage area in the back here. And this is the same one we cut for the Triton. And it actually fit right here in this compartment here, in the front, this back compartment. And what you wanna do is put it to where this lip will shut. And then your, your uh, latch and everything will shut as you can see swing around I didn't put the velcro on it yet because we're still jumping around but you can actually uh, as you can see it will shut in that compartment so that that's a spot you can put it in the Ranger uh, I've looked at it before up here at the front of the boat too so let's walk up here to rod lockers uh, this compartment here has a uh, lip on it, this, this model of boat, that has the step-down lip. I'm not recommending it for this spot of the boat, but you can put it in, in, in this storage area. Okay, we're still in the Ranger uh, 520C. Uh, you can actually, one that comes from stock, just like this, it's not been cut yet. Uh, you can cut one for the front rod locker area by putting it right up here at the front end of it the rod locker and what you'll do on this one is you would actually cut off at an angle on both angles you may would have to round the corner but it will actually shut on this area of the of the, uh, of the ranger and you know of course it ain't cut yet but uh, I'll try to put it right here just to kind of show you how it's gonna shut so it would actually shut if it was cut and trimmed in this area here about right in this area here okay let's go hunt another boat okay we're here at the pontoon boats uh, this is a south bay pontoon uh, we've got uh, several of them here and we're going to go see what compartments it'll fit under the seat uh, where the seating area is and see what we can do come on let's check it out okay we're here at the seat area we've popped the seat up to get into the storage uh, this will clearly you can clearly see that this will fit in here by just trimming just a little bit off the edge by setting it in like this, it would actually fit down on the bottom lip. Of course, you'd have good storage. You could throw, you know, stuff in that area too. Keep it separated. Uh, we've got the back area also, same way. It fits in uh, the back area. Uh, different compartments in, in the seat area it fits. And uh, we've looked at the little bitty seats on this boat over here. If you can kind of film over here on this other pontoon it's got the smaller seat it also fit in that area uh, we've got several spots in the pontoon boats that it fits also by just a little trim okay, let's go over here and look at some of these uh, bright boats and we're gonna see if the uh, what it fits in them and we'll we'll get right over here let's come on with me okay we're in the bright boat uh, as you can see in this underneath the storage here under the seat uh, we've put one in here it, it needs maybe a little bit of trimming on the back put your velcro the, the lid shuts great uh, we've got also another compartment compartment here this was no trim or anything it actually fits uh, really nice there you can put your velcro down you could trim it if you want more room but uh, as you can see the, the lid shuts great got a good good area for some uh, snacks or something you could store uh, we went around and put it in uh, different kind of uh, boats and different compartments throughout this uh, throughout the store uh, I'd like to thank Bunch Marine for letting us come in and, and check out these different boats and check out the different areas we could put our product in and uh, check us out on easytro.com for all of our new products thank you